I am the quintessential girly queen. I would describe my look as a Barbie princess, super girly, super fun, super feminine, all things pink. In the last episode, my sister stole my look and she went to the Barbie side. So today I'm going to have a little bit of revenge and I'm going to steal her look and aesthetic. And who knows, I could be the new queen of the goths in the family. Hey guys! Oh, it's really scary! Hi, I'm Dara, nice to meet you. I'm Emily, come on in. Thank you. My name is Emily and I am the ultimate Barbie princess. Super girly, super pink. Yeah, that's me. I basically like to think of myself like a doll. The ultimate girly girl. It has to be pink. I'm kind of inspired a little bit by 60s fashion. I love like go-go boots, mini skirts, girly, flowery, floral patterns, anything that makes me feel ultra feminine. I'm not at all a tomboy. I love jewelry as well. Anything sparkly, anything glitzy and glamour. I just want to feel like a princess. In the previous episode, my sister stole my look and she actually looked kind of good. I look like I'm going to go and run for like Congress or something. So today I'm getting my revenge and I'm going to steal her look. I'm going Barbie to go. And yeah, she's got some competition now. Hello, sister. Hey, girl. Are you ready to join the dark side? I am, but I'm scared. Come along. So, Emily, today we're going to transform you mm -hmm. with a gothic makeup look. Yeah, I'm terrified. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to start off by making you nice and pale, and then we'll go for a dramatic eyeliner look and some dark lipstick. I've never worn black lipstick no. before. And your outfit, everyone's got a lovely outfit picked out for you. Oh gosh, <laughs> what's it gonna be? I'm probably not gonna be able to walk in whatever shoes she's gonna get me. <laughs> nice and full coverage, <laughs> nice and pale. So we're actually mixing white in with your concealer. It's actually pure white. White, white foundation. What do you think your sister's like? I have always looked up to her because she doesn't care about what people think of her. People yell at her on the streets and people have thrown things at her before because they just, they don't get it. Yeah. I'm a little bit more reserved. Yeah. I get nervous about kind of what people would say. I feel like I was kind of maybe a little bit of an ugly duckling in my head growing up. I didn't feel like I was always like the prettiest. So I feel like I've kind of manifested this style to make myself feel beautiful. Do you ever feel judged for the way you look? I do think that people do judge me and I think a lot of people when they meet me also think that I'm going to be a mean girl. That is a big problem that I've faced is people thinking that I'm just going to be a bit nasty. They just expect that mean girl energy which I, I definitely don't have at all. What colours are we going to use? Grey, black, silver. <laughs> no pink? No pink. As a kid I used to play with dolls like really really girly dolls and I always thought I'm gonna grow up to look like these dolls they're beautiful they are so fashionable and yeah it's kind of just always been a part of me I think as well growing up with a sister that was kind of tomboy and goth I wanted to differentiate myself from her I feel like we were already compared to each other in so many other ways. Just for being sisters? Yeah, so I think kind of adopted very different styles because it allowed us to feel a bit more unique. I do think it's funny though that we came from the same family. <laughs> it always surprises people. What do you think Bethan thinks of your book? I would say she probably thinks my style is quite boring. <laughs> I think that's how she would describe it, it's just so plain. I think my dad would probably struggle with the fact that he has two daughters that dress like gods. <laughs> my boyfriend loves me as I look now. I think he would probably drop dead at the fact that I would start dressing goth. I think he would be terrified. Who knows, maybe I'll be completely transformed and we'll have two goths in the family. Now the exciting part, we're gonna do your eyeliner. And I'm gonna use an eyeliner for lip liner. I'm going out for dinner like this with my yeah. boyfriend, yeah. I think he's going to ask me to wipe it off as soon as we're done. <laughs> Things that goss would do. Wig time. Looks just like Bevan's hair, to yeah. be honest. There we go. Ta-da. <laughs> You're looking amazing. Are you ready for the big reveal? Yes. Three, two, one. Oh my God. <laughs> 
<laughs> what do you I think? I look like Bevan. That is literally Bevan. Oh, <laughs> terrifying. <laughs> oh my goodness. I actually quite like the makeup. Yeah, I told you. Oh, yeah, uh, I'm surprised. The black lipstick. I don't want to cramp her style, but like, I think I look kind of good. <laughs> no, I love it. I think it's really cool. I'm just excited to show everyone now, I think. Daughter's look, uh, Barbie sort of style, blondy hair, very gregarious. She's always been that way. Like the Barbie, pinky, girly stuff, nice shoes, nice dresses. A bit apprehensive to see her, to see what she looks like. Hopefully she doesn't stick with it. You know, I don't need two gods in my life. Are you open to a bit of change, Ali? Um, it's going to be a real eye opener. I think she'll look good no matter what she wears, so whatever makes her happy, you know. I am very excited to see what Emily looks like. She got to see me suffer when I had to get into her style. So maybe this is my own form of payback. I just hope she doesn't do it better because it might give me a mild existential crisis. Hey guys! Wow. Oh my oh. 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 What do you think? Do we look like twins women? Oh! Scary because I was scared. It's really scary. Oh my god, they really peeled you down though. Yeah, got pale makeup on. First of all, well done. You walked out here. I expected you to fall about 10 times. You must have the tiniest waist in the world. I cannot breathe. Girl, years of training. Years of training. Look at you. No. You're so pretty. We're matching. It's not a good look. Really? <laughs> not for me. <laughs> Yeah, I think you could be my body double in the movie, stunt double, yeah. I feel like our faces look so much more similar, like we never look like siblings. Do you like it? Um, it's absolutely terrifying, I'm not gonna lie. What do you think? I was surprised that I liked it. Really? I'm not gonna lie, shoes are a nightmare. Yeah. I don't know why you would do that to Christ. yourself. Do you feel in mild pain? Yes, like mild, oh. continuous discomfort. All over my body, the corset, the shoes. That's yeah. golf. So what do you think, Daddy? Do you like it? <laughs> I think I'd rather the other look here, yeah. to be honest. But no. Tell me I look better, though. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Would you wear it again? I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of thinking about when I'm gonna wipe it off. <laughs> I think it definitely brings out like an edgier side of me. That's why I wanted to do this, because I feel like it was an opportunity to kind of push myself out of my comfort zone. You've done that, yeah. I wish. Hello, ladies. Two yeah. gots for the price of one. <laughs> Buy one, get one free, baby. We have to keep it on now for at least today, huh? Yeah, we're, we told you we're going through. on a date. Wait, Wait, oh, yeah. Hot date. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well done. Huh? Thanks, Danny. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> it's a look. To be honest, I was quite surprised. I thought I was going to hate it, but I kind of like it. As beautiful as this is, and as much as it suits Bevan, it's not me. I think you look beautiful, and I'm so happy we got invited back for the sequel to do this. <laughs> but I love your style. I want you to embrace your pink nature. Wear them little go-go -go boots. I want you to wear what makes you happy. And I think that's being a little pink princess. I think it's taught me that I do know who I am, and I dress the way that I want to dress, and the way that makes me feel the most confident.